What is up guys, coming at you again, another throw around Thursday. Today, after a very long awaited time stretch, we are gonna be going small game hunting. That is right guys, for all of you hunting fanatics that used to see me go small game hunting on my farm, I am actually gonna be getting the chance today to go small game hunting again. Now, we are in a much more, you know, urban environment than we were at the farm, so this is gonna have to have different set of uh, procedures in place to be able to make this a successful hunt today. But I definitely think you guys are gonna like it. I definitely think you guys are gonna enjoy the ride. Now, today's weapon of choice on this small game hunt is gonna be none other than the original Bug Assault Rifle. I absolutely love this thing. I love this thing in premise. I love this thing in theory. I love this thing in function. I have had this for probably I don't know, a solid year. And I've been wanting to bring you guys a review on it for, I don't know, ever since I got it. Uh, this is a really, really, really cool thing for both kids and adults. I can't seem to put it down, especially if I have any type of good target on hand to shoot at. And when I say any type of good target, that's anything that pretty much creeps, crawls, or flies. I've taken out spiders with this guy. I've taken out flies with this guy. I've taken out big daddy long legs with this guy. Honestly, it should have more hash marks on it than my actual pellet rifles. We'll just keep the hash marks imaginary for now because this is a plastic stock. Now, what is the Bug Assault Rifle? The Bug Assault Rifle is a table salt powered pump action pest control gun. Basically, this is for hunting small game. Really, really small game. Like all the pests that would get past your screen door, basically. Now, I have a bait set up in the field currently, as well as a uh, scope cam, as it were, to go ahead and mount on this guy, so we can get some up-close shots of this hunt in the field. And when I say the field, we're definitely talking about my backyard, and when we're talking about the bait, it's a watermelon rind. But it should serve the purpose of drawing in some flies so that you guys can see just how much fun I've been having with it. Just a couple of things to look at here, guys. I'm gonna lean across the table. When you uh, cock it, that rear sight right there actually pops up and uh, comes into view so you could use it to go ahead and acquire your target. It's an automatic safety, so when you pump it, the safety is also engaged. Click the safety off, rear sight retracts. It's pretty good design, actually. Standard table salt, nothing special, nothing important, just basic salt from a salt shaker. All right, guys, well, without further ado, let's get right into our small game hunt with the Bug Assault Rifle. All right, guys, there's actually some flies on our bait. I don't know why I'm whispering. I don't know if flies have ears or not, but I'm gonna treat this like any other hunt and try and keep real quiet so I can hopefully sneak up on these guys with my bug assault rifle and uh, put a swift and timely end to them. Here we go, guys. Oh, we got him, guys. Look at that.
guys. So with every hunt, you never know what you're gonna get into. Honestly, looking through the GoPro is much more difficult than looking through the open sights on the bug assault rifle, and I had better success when I wasn't trying to show you guys how cool it was. Definitely got some big things planned for you guys. Definitely spent some money to try and invest into the channel. Definitely tried to bring you guys the best content that I can as far as the air guns are concerned. If you like this brief, but in my mind, epic look at the bug assault rifle, give this video a thumbs up. If you wanna see more content like this, make sure you subscribe for more with that notifications button. If you really like this video, make sure you share it so somebody else can see it. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.